Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who don't know, my name is Aisha. I'm a medical doctor, personal trainer, and a weight loss coach. I bring you videos about weight loss, health, and nutrition to help you along on your weight loss journey. Now in today's video, I'm going to do something completely different. I've never done this before. Um, I mentioned in one of my previous videos that I have recently given birth to my first baby. One of the things that I'm focusing on for myself is to get into a routine again with healthy eating and really nourishing my body with the best food possible. So I wanted to take you through like a day of what I'm eating. Um, let's see how this goes because I've never, like I said, I've never done anything like this before, but I wanted to share with you um, what I'm basically eating postpartum to not only nourish my body and to give me energy and to just make me feel good while I'm sleep deprived and struggling with a newborn, but also as I kind of move myself forward to get my fitness level back to where I wanted it to be. I want to make sure that I'm having the best food possible. So um, I hope that you enjoy this video. If you do, give it a thumbs up and let me know in the comments if you want to see more videos like this and make sure you subscribe as well so that you can um, keep up with the videos. But uh, let's get straight into it. I start off my day with a big glass of water because I get so thirsty, especially with breastfeeding. And I also take a couple of vitamins that are also for breastfeeding. So I am making an omelette for breakfast and I'm going to start off with just spraying the pan with this coconut oil spray that I have. I'm not a fan of it, but I'm just using it to get it finished. And then I'm just going to chuck in all of the different vegetables that I'm putting in. So I've got some bell pepper and some spinach lots of spinach <laughs> but it's okay because it always wilts down you always think that you've got loads but you know it's not going to be that much in the end i love having omelets because you can put in lots of different vegetables and then lots of protein as well from the eggs so i tend to use two eggs in my omelets um, and then i just mix them up like you see me doing here and i tend to just chuck in some seasoning as well so i think i used salt and some black pepper along with some crushed chilies because you know i like to have some chili and some paprika now i just make sure that all of the veg has softened i basically cook the spinach up until the point where there's barely any water left in the pan and then i throw in the egg and i just move the pan around to make sure that the egg covers all of the vegetables like you see me doing here, this is how you want it to look. I don't know why I'm acting like you guys don't know how to make omelettes because I'm sure you do. One thing I do is once it's looking like it's cooked, I throw it into the oven just to grill the top bit of the omelette so that I don't have to flip it over in order to cook it. Now you see, this is what my omelette turned out to be like. I topped it with some mozzarella cheese and then I'm having it with two slices of toast because you've got to get some carbs in there I can't be living without carbs. I am a fan of carbs. Along with my trusted cup of tea because I can't have a day without tea in the morning. <laughs> I've been working on my computer for the last couple of hours here and I just wanna show you what I'm having for my snacks. So I've got some grapes um, and a big bottle of water to keep me going and another cup of tea. I just need to stay hydrated. So that big bottle of water gets filled up at least two, three times in the day. Breastfeeding mamas, you know what I'm talking about, we get thirsty. <laughs> For lunch, I threw together this salad. So I've just got lots of greeny leafy salad and some tomatoes topped with some chicken kebabs that I made. I had these frozen in the freezer and I was so glad that I'd made them because they make the easiest thing for lunch. Just chuck them in the air fryer and I'm ready to go with a big, big, side of salad and obviously a glass of water. I tend to snack quite a few times throughout the day and this time around I'm having another cup of tea with this bulk powders cookie. It's basically a protein cookie. It tastes so delicious and yeah, makes the perfect snack. For dinner, I have got some chicken that I had marinated the day before and I used this peri peri mix that I have and I've just thrown that into the pan with lots of different veg. I've got some carrots, some potatoes and bell peppers. And on top of that, I'm also gonna boil some vegetables as well, which I mostly just like to have broccoli boiled. And this is the final outcome. I've got my chicken, two chicken legs um, and all the veg alongside it. It's pretty easy to throw together a meal like this if you've already marinated the chicken. You just literally bung it in the oven and get on with whatever you need to do and then it's ready. So I hope that you guys have enjoyed this um, video. If you've liked this style of things of seeing what I'm eating while I'm breastfeeding then let me know and I will do more videos like this. So make sure you subscribe and like this video if you've enjoyed it and I will see you guys next time.